Good to see you. Oh, why, hello there. Pleasure to meet you. I'm Quinn. You too, stranger. I know a lot of people around here don't take kindly to humans wandering around, but I've met a lot of your people in my travels. Yeah, just east of here. Bunch of guys with guns are holed up there. Yeah, see ya. Okay. Hello, my beautiful America. This is hmm? President Eden, and it's time we had a Oh. Oh, you know hey, look at that. A human with hair. Hey, you think we can do something about that? Order and security. These yeah, man, that's what I do. I cut hair. I know, I know you look around here and there ain't a lot of work to show off, right? These corpses only got half a head of this stuff, so I never get a chance to work on a full head. Come on, no charge. Hmm. Now we're talking. What do you need? <laughs> sure, give me a haircut, man. Another satisfied customer. Remember, no charge. Awesome. Thanks, man. Hey, you. <laughs> talk to Azrakal. I said, talk to Azrakal. Yeah. Well, now, looky here. We got us a smooth skin that I ain't ever seen before. I'm Azrakal, and this. This is the Ninth Circle. Hmm. Folks got problems, and I got liquor to sell them. Well, liquor and a few other pick-me-ups. Huh? You need anything, uh, you just let me know. That's Sharon. Let's just say, well, he's a loyal employee. Don't mess with me, and he won't mess with you. <laughs> no, he is not. Sir, you insult me. I do not believe in slavery. It is an abomination. I am a firm believer in personal choice. To force another person into bondage is unthinkable. Chains are earned, never forced. Sharon made some choices that landed him in my employ. The matters of our contract is between him and I, no one else. Oh, would you now? He's a highly valuable asset to me and to the Ninth Circle. What did you have in mind? I suppose we could do that. Uh, Although you might not like the deal that I have to offer. You see, I don't like competition. Not at all. It goes against every principle that I have as a businessman. So the fact that there is another source for booze in town troubles me. Greta, the waitress oh. over at Carol's. I want you to kill her. I don't care how. Just make it quiet. Do it, and you can have Sharon's contract. No stomach for hard work, eh? No matter. If you don't want to do the job, then come up with the cash. Otherwise, I'll just hang on to this contract. Why, whatever do you mean? I'm a simple barkeep, nothing more. Oh, no, 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 don't be hasty. I'm sure that we can work out a compromise. Here, step this way and let me show you what I have. I... 
You're kidding, right? <laughs> Come back when you have a serious offer. You're kidding. That's a shame. Feel. Think you'd never seen a ghoul up close before. Is that so? Even if I call you a milk sucking, mutant loving, water stealing son of a whore? a human that knows this place. Too many of you think we're all just zombies. They don't know or don't care that we're just as human as they are inside. We bleed, we hurt, we regret. And you know what really pisses me off? They think the only way to kill us is to shoot us in the head, like in the old zombie stories, and that'll put us out of our misery. Hey, I know. Maybe you could help me even the score. The feeling's mutual, smooth skin. But that never stopped a business deal. A lot of you humans are bigots. You don't like ghouls and treat us like zombies, calling us brain eaters and shufflers. Well, they're gonna pay. Uh, before I get into the details, you don't have anything against killing, do you? Or oh, the right money, huh? I've got this list of people. Ghoul bigots. Real scum. I've only got four guys left on the list. Started with eleven. All of them hate ghouls and treat us like we're zombies. They all deserve to die, but it has to be done with a headshot. Just like the old stories where zombies can only be killed that way. I'll give you a hundred caps for each of them. If they die some other way, I'm only paying twenty-five, though. Excellent. Take this sniper rifle. You'll need it. Here's a list of the guys in their last known locations. Word will get around at ten pennies killed, but I'll need proof for the others. Bring me back something personal from each of them as proof. Like a key or a ring or something. They're ghoul haters. I want them all dead. Don't you think that's enough? This is that special key. be a lesson for all the ghoul haters out there. Here's your payment for the key. Interesting. Don't keep me waiting. Stop. Dave. Don't you have something to do? <laughs> Don't keep me waiting. Huh. Interesting. All right. Um, I think I'm going to call it a part there for now. Um, thanks again for watching, everyone. I greatly appreciate it. 
Um, next time we pick up, uh, we're gonna go through a shit ton of quests. Jesus Christ. Will little Brian Wilkes ever find a home? I don't know. Will I ever find my way to the city? That's a question. Alright everyone, well thanks again, and hope you all have a good night. Take care.